This doesn't have to take long. That's up to you. Do you know a man named Panikoff? What about Alan York? David Palmer? Of course. He's running for president. The attempt on his life has failed. The perpetrators will soon be in custody, and you're already implicated. If you help me now, I can get you a deal. And then they repeat. I have no idea what you're talking about. Your hands are sweaty. Of course. I'm scared. Who are you meeting on your way to the airport? A man named Kevin Carroll. And who is he? A businessman. Like myself. He sells machine tools. And why were you meeting him in a parking garage? What's his idea? I had nothing to do with it. I've already told you everything I know. Yeah, it's me. Run a background check on a Kevin Carroll. Allegedly a machine tool salesman. Probably an alias. Yeah. Let me show you something. You ever heard of the Russian Gulag? What? It's a string of prisons in northern Siberia. The Russians, they don't have a lot of high-tech equipment, so they have to make do with what they have. Kind of like what I'm doing right now. You probably don't think that I can force this towel down your throat. But trust me, I can. All the way. Except for this one piece, which I hold on to. And as soon as your stomach starts to digest, I pull it out, taking your stomach lining with it. Most people, they take about a week to die. It's very painful. Son of a man, I... I don't want to hurt you. But I will do anything to protect my family. I want to show you something. It's in my wallet. Open it, please. I know you miss your family. I know you want to see your family again. I would give anything to see one again, my man. Mr. Bauer. Believe me, if there was anything I could tell you that could help, I would tell you. 